you are listening to the Equatorial Microphone Array, which is this black circle object right in front of me with 16 microphones along its equator. The noise that you might be hearing, that one originates from the ventilation system, which is everywhere around me, and you might even be hearing some music in the background. It is Friday night on campus. This particular prototype was built by the Audio Communication Group at University of Technology Berlin in collaboration with Neumann. They built it for a slightly different purpose in which we're using it today. Today we are using the device to perform a seventh order spherical harmonic recording of the sound field in this room. Or in other words, we're performing a seventh order ambisonic recording of the sound field, which we're rendering binaurally. We developed this method in collaboration with Facebook Reality Labs. Because we're rendering binaurally, it is very important for what follows that you're listening through headphones and that you're imagining yourself at the location of the microphone array. Because if I then walk around you, you will hear me on the according side. If you're hearing me on the other side, you have to flip your headphones. I can keep walking, I can pass behind you until I reach the other side. I can get very close and talk right into your ear. The ambisonic format, it supports head tracking, which means that we can react on the user's head movements upon playback if the according hardware is available, which, if, which it is not right now, but let's instead emulate the experience. Let's watch this gentleman. As he's turning his head to the right, you will be hearing my voice going to the left. Let's try and synchronize our movements. Let's turn our heads to the right, and you will keep hearing my voice in front of me. Uh, you. Let's try the other side. Let's turn our heads to the left and my voice will stay where it is supposed to. Another thing you, you might be wondering is, well, con uh, contrary to conventional ambisonics microphone arrays, this one has microphones only along a one-dimensional contour inside the horizontal plane. So what happens if the microphone records sound that does not originate from the horizontal plane? Well, I can demonstrate that to you. If I talk into the microphone array from above, you might not necessarily he be hearing my voice from above, which is probably not even the case with a conventional ambisonic microphone array. But still, I mean, you can hear my voice and you can hear everything that I'm saying.